Yellow Jackets dropped the first set tonight against Alaska Fairbanks, but battled back and won in five sets. Kendall, what was the decisive factor tonight? You guys did not give up the whole match. I think we finally had that just battle mentality that coach has been um, pushing for us to achieve, um, especially after that first set. I think we all kind of realized, you know, they're here to play and they're a legit team, so we just got to battle for every point and um, – it was a complete team effort, and I think it took everyone just doing their jobs, um, being super excited about every point, and um, it just took everyone to finish this match. And I, it was just so fun to have that energy and the, just the battle mentality the whole game. And you guys took the second set, and it looked like you were in a little bit of trouble there in the third set. You're down 20 to 15, but you just rallied, battled, and you found a way to win that third set. How big was that in terms of shifting momentum back onto your side? That was huge. Um, we're a team that really needs that momentum. Um, we're actually really good at fighting back. And so um, it's frustrating that we dig ourselves in those holes, but it's nice to know that we can always dig our way back. Um, I think that was huge for us, too, winning that third game. Um, it gave us so much confidence. Um, just being able to battle back and, and having fun, and that gave us huge momentum going into the fourth um, and being able to finish in the fifth, knowing that we can beat them. and. Um, if everyone just does their part, we can we can get the win. You guys were starting to pull away there in the fifth set. You were up 12 to seven, and then they started to chip back into it 12 10. You kind of put a stop to that with a nice little reaction kill, just mm -hmm. instinct tucked it away, um, short court. Um, talk about that play and how that kind of helped you guys reestablish yourselves and win. Um, I think the fact that we started pretty strong that set um, got us that lead, gave us some confidence. Um, but we knew they were gonna, they were going to fight back. They battle for every point. Um, they're a tough team, and so uh, I think it was huge because our hitters were, you know, going for everything. Um, and I think it was just a good thing to mix it up because I don't think they were expecting it. Um, I had a little, I was being, I was getting a little frustrated because my dubs haven't been working as well lately. Um, so that was good confidence-wise for myself. Um, and it was just fun to see everyone's reactions. We all got so jacked and. I think it was just a big play um, for everyone. And if I wasn't on the net, if my pastors didn't push me up, I wasn't able to do that. So it was just, it was fun. It was really fun. You had some really good chemistry tonight with Audrey Marsh. She led the team in kills. Ashlyn Ward also in double figures. And Stormy Simeon up there as well. Talk about um, just the overall balance between your hitters tonight. Um, I think that was huge, too. I think before, we've kind of lacked a balance in our offense, um, everyone showing up on the same night. And so I think that was also huge. Um, being able to go to different hitters and knowing that they're going to put the ball away. Um, it's huge having Audrey just swinging so smart. She's swinging so good. Um, she has so much more confidence now. And I think getting our pin hitters back in it, um, they kind of struggled on Tuesday. We had a lot of errors, and I didn't see that a lot tonight. Um, so it was good to, to have them be in the game again, swinging hard, and um, having confidence in all my hitters is huge. Um, so it was nice to be able to feed it to all of them, knowing that, you know, they're probably going to put the ball away. And now you have Alaska Anchorage coming up on Saturday, but a nice win here with, um, in five sets to give you guys some confidence heading into that match. Um, I think confidence is huge for us. Um, getting a win, especially on a home court, is huge. We've struggled a lot at home this year, so um, confidence is just a huge confidence builder. Um, Anchorage is tough, I mean, but we have nothing to lose. We're the underdog. Um, and I don't think they're going to expect, expect a lot out of us. Um, so I think that's a huge advantage for us. If we can start strong and play, play strong and everyone do their part, I really think we can do some good things on Saturday. Yellow Jackets, an exciting five-set victory tonight over Alaska Fairbanks. A back-and-forth match. It came down all the way to the final points there in the fifth set. Audrey, just talk about the way that match finished and how exciting it was to get this win. Um, first of all, it was really nice to finally battle and actually come out and win. And I think that it was just a combined team effort. We passed well. We had several hitters hit really well. And Kendall did a great job all night of putting us in one-on-one -on -one situations that we could take care of the ball. So it was nice to see all that come together and to take a win and to battle the whole time. And you led your team in kills tonight. Talk about um, what, what was feeling good for you on the attack and your chemistry with Kendall tonight? Honestly, Kendall led the way the whole time on that. Um, she put me in great situations, talked to me the whole time. I had passers telling me where to hit. It was just nice to come in and blend and uh, see all that work together. And this is a team that you beat at their place on the road. How did that help you um, tonight seeing them a second time? Um, it was just nice to kind of know their tendencies, um, where they went when they are in trouble, um, and just knowing their hitters so that we could play defense really well around them. 
and now with this momentum, you have another match coming up on Saturday against Alaska Anchorage, very tough team. Um, your thoughts on how an inspirational win like this, winning in five sets, uh, will help you heading into that match? Well, this whole uh, this whole week, since it'll be our third match, um, we've just increasingly battled every time. And so coming in with this win, knowing that we played better than we did on Tuesday, knowing that Tuesday we played better than we did last week, I think that Saturday we come in knowing that we're going to play better still, and we battle with them point for point. Down to the wire tonight, and Alterowitz, Jim, coach, the match coming down to a fifth set, and you were able to pull it off tonight. Talk about the way that your team was able to finish tonight against Alaska Fairbanks. Yeah, I'm so proud of our team. We, we've been playing, you know, a little bit inconsistent, but we've never really done well towards the end of matches. And for us to finally be able to battle right to the end uh, and pull a close one out like that at home, uh, I think will just give us confidence going through uh, and a great way to start the second half of the conference season. Looked like a major turning point. You guys were trailing 20 to 15 in the third set. You found a way to battle all the way back mm -hmm. and win that set. Talk about that being a momentum changer for you guys tonight. Yeah, definitely momentum. Um, I think we, we started to play some, some better defense. Kimmy Kirk had a, a great night tonight. Uh, I think she's in the 20 uh, plus digs and uh, we haven't seen that from her uh, this season. And she really stepped up for us uh, and gave us those second and third opportunities. Audrey Mars leading the team in kills tonight. Um, talk about the way she was attacking and working well with Kendall Williams. Yeah, Audrey's been doing a, a great job lately. Um, she's she's taken some big swings for us, and she's changed her shots up a little bit. Um, uh, beginning of the season, she was hitting that same same shot every time, and uh, with the variety now, she's getting a lot more effective uh, and seeing open court a little bit more. And talk about that first set. You guys kind of came out a little bit flat, maybe mm -hmm. lost it, but. It didn't discourage you. You came out, won the next two, and ultimately won the match tonight. Yeah, I mean, we could have we could have folded after that first set. Uh, we've done that in the past, and we came out uh, in that second set and and really started to battle. And that's what we've really been trying to do a lot lately is just get into that battle gritty mode of, you know, putting our foot down and saying, you know, we're a good team and and we we deserve to to win these sets. And then Saturday you have Alaska Anchorage coming in. Uh, talk about the momentum that you have now with the an inspirational win like this going into fifth to a fifth set and holding on for the victory. Yeah, I, I definitely think this gives us a lot of confidence going forward. And it's always fun to play a nationally ranked team, especially on your home court. And you know there's there's not a lot of pressure on us and we can just go out there and, and be aggressive and you never know what's gonna happen.